Welcome back to the channel. Real quick here, just a little video in my phone because as I am seeing what happened here in the Capitol Police and the Capitol incident, all this, I'm seeing every every Senate or every Senator talking about this and giving thanks for the Capitol Police and saying how, oh wow, this is the first time since 18 yada yada and what happened, it was a disgrace and this and that and they are so surprised really really surprised about this and they are so ashamed of what happened and 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 it's so disgusting that what happened happened so i'm gonna say something here very quickly first of all i don't agree with that type of behavior and i definitely condemn that um you know i've been talking about peaceful um you know strategies and things like that obviously the people that did that which by the way i'm not totally convinced that it was all trump supporters i'm sure there was some trump supporters there but i'm sure there were other people that were not trump supporters but one thing that it, it amazes me as i listen to this guys and again i'm gonna say it again because some of you guys don't really get it sometimes i don't agree with that type of behavior i don't agree with assaulting police officers i don't agree by doing that by force uh we should have done it peacefully uh, but what i think to myself that as i see these politicians talking about this first of all no one condemned none of them many of them didn't some of them did but many of them didn't condemn you know blm and antifa when they burned down our communities in fact they call them peaceful protests I guess that was a peaceful protest, right? And well, other thing that I, I think to myself is like, really? There are cities like Chicago that every weekend, 50 people get shot. Really, it's sad. There is communities being burned down by BLM and Antifa and all that it happened. And none of you guys says anything. None of you guys were like, oh, is this crass? You know, I can't believe that that happened. And you know what the difference between you guys and those community is it's simple you got your own private security you had capital police to defend you capital uh, capital police fbi swat teams and all these fancy tactical guys to protect you secret service who protects our communities when things like this happen who protects our communities like ferguson when it got burned down to the city who protects places like los angeles when their cities were being attacked who protects new york as looting and, and mass chaos is happening and people stealing no one they don't have that privilege of having private police protecting them they don't but now we got to sit down here and again you know horrific event what happened i don't agree with that stuff but we have to sit here and listen to you guys saying we were scared americans are scared and what are you doing you're hiding behind your private police you are rich you know with all your money while americans in places like chicago are getting shot every weekend and your answer is defund the police gun control and let criminals out of jail so give me a break if you're a christian out there pray for our country because we really need it i appreciate our support or your support here to the channel and everything you guys do for the channel i really really appreciate it stay tuned more videos coming up and as always god is in control